Welcome back everybody to Let's Play Heroes of Might and Magic 6. Oh man, it's been a while since I, uh, since I, well, let's play this, because I played it, like, well, this morning actually, but also a lot yesterday. Finally finished the third mission, and I started the fourth too, of the Inferno campaign, but yeah. Feels like it's been a while since I made videos, which it has been. I think the last time was like Thursday or Friday, last Thursday or Friday, which by the way, today is Tuesday, May 15th, otherwise known in the uh, gaming world as that day Diablo 3 came out. Hold on, can I recruit something? No. Okay. Can you build something? No. Can I build something in a couple of crystal. No, I guess I just totally wasted that. Well, okay, so, like I was saying, May 15th, the day Diablo 3 came out. Am I gonna get it? No, not yet. Anyway, oh, that was useful. I'm stupid. Um, yeah, I'm not gonna get it because I'm kinda broke. I'm not really broke, but close enough. Um, close enough that I'd rather have a job before I start buying stuff like Diablo 3. Not that Diablo 3 is bad, it's an excellent game, I'm sure. But, but, uh, yeah, I want to find a job first. Such goes life. And by the way, that job interview I got, I don't know how much I, I talked to you about. I know I told you about it, kind of, a little bit. Uh, that job interview that I got... Um, she called me back, cause, and she was like, I would have chosen you, I would have picked you, you were like perfect fit and stuff and all, and she was being kind and all, and then she, it's like, but because of the student strike, I can't really, I mean, it's not set in stone that I'm not going there, but it's pretty much certain. The problem is that this student strike I've been on, for a long time now, and this was unprotected. This is also an, an unprecedented, I think. But yeah, this student strike is making it really hard to know when um, I'm going to be available to do anything, right? So she needs me for a certain date, uh, and I cannot guarantee that I'm going to be available at that date. If I, I could still be in school, I should, I should have finished um, by the end of April towards the end of April, okay? I should be finished right now, I should be working and stuff and gaining, you know, money and buying Diablo 3, but no, because I'm on strike. It's for a good cause, by the way, I'm not complaining about the strike, I'm voting for the strike, this is a good cause. But, <laughs> my problem is that I'm... I don't want liches, shoo. the will of Kabeleth. You are weaker than I thought. Kabaleth is the last person in the world I should trust. But when you've got a Prince of Destruction in your body, you don't get to choose your friends. Whatever. Yeah, it's Asgall's fault. You tell him. By the way, I'm totally sacrificing this. Because I... You see this teleporter here? The one-way entrance is next to a castle here. So I'm just charging. That's what I'm doing right now. Uh, going back to my story though, yeah. Student strike making it really uncertain that I can be available in time. So she's kind of... Uh, she told me she'd be stalling for like a week getting other job interviews to see... Uh, to get other options, you know. And... Um, that she'd call me back. I, no, don't go there. Retreat. Uh, that she'd call me back eventually. So, she's gonna call me back eventually, probably to tell me that really it can't work. I'm probably still gonna be... The only way that I'm going to be available is if they cancel the session, which is, which is not exactly something I'd be cheering for, you know? I wouldn't be completely screwed by it, but pretty much screwed anyways, you know? So, we'll see what happens. Doubting my chances, but we'll see what happens. Right, so this is the first castle. Oh, by the way, today I'm aiming to kind of just rush this 
get all this today. Tomorrow get the stat bonuses and then finish the map. And uh, I guess Friday I'm gonna start the third map. Yay! See Ham, hello. Have I? It's been too long, hey. I I don't even remember who I've fought and who I haven't fought. I've probably fought See Ham before. I will say though, this and this there's a lot of, not the rest. So yeah, I'm not getting Diablo 3 yet. I am going to get it eventually. And now the other question that is in my mind, maybe not in yours, probably not in yours, is how am I going to make videos out of this? Uh, I don't know. Completely undecided. To be honest, there's going to be probably 20 to 40 people doing Diablo 3 videos starting today or tomorrow. So... It's not like me doing it would be very um, innovative. What I was thinking is, if I really want to do it, I could do. Um, I could see myself doing. Well, okay. It depends on what, how the uh, difficulty uh, works in that game. But if it's like Diablo 2, where you play it once, and then you can play it on Nightmare, and then you can play it on Hell, which is the highest difficulty, and it's made for the highest levels, and you know all that. All that good stuff. What I was thinking, so, is um, if it's working like that, I could just play on my own time, play the normal, play the nightmare, and then, and then, um, maybe uh, make videos. Uh, let's let's play videos of me playing on on hard, on the hardest, which would be hell, I guess, if we were playing the other two. Because this is something I'm guessing not a lot of people are gonna. Let's play the hardest difficulty, just because they're probably all gonna start. Oh, we're eager to to, to to do videos, so they're gonna do like the normal level, and um, completely ignore. I uh, should not have put them here because then I could charge both the elites here. Oh well, I'm just gonna charge the Um I kind of need somebody though somebody cuz next turn I need to take care of oh there's an obstacle I need to take care of the vampires and they're gonna be a problem so yeah maybe I could do the hardest difficulty of um, of Diablo 3 that that could that could be something because very few people, I'm expecting very few people to actually do that. To do that, you'd like... That would imply uh, playing three times through the... Because most people are gonna play it through... Uh, starting from the first level. Most people would play it... Um, would have to play uh, on video kind of three times the game. So, I'm not sure most people wouldn't do that, I'm guessing. Maybe that's just me, but I don't think many people would do that. So maybe in a very long time I'm gonna do something like that. But I'm doubting it. Very much. And you know what? I think I don't even care about losses. So shut up. Go away. Oh yeah, see? The gated stack kill died, so everybody got this morale. Thankfully... Uh, this morale? Really? Is that a word? No. I don't think so. Ooh, liches. Why didn't you have liches with your hero, you dumb, you dumb Siham? Whatever. I don't care if he's being stupid, it's just helping me if he's being stupid. Yeah. Alright, I'm gonna put you here, you kinda here, you kinda here. And I'm gonna have Pitlows over there. That's how, that's, that was my formation on my offline run. Not that it's particularly good or bad or anything, I'm just... It turned out that way and I kind of just kept it, so I'm used to it, so I'm going to keep it. These and these are in the middle, uh, they have access to all this. These are fast, they have access to this. The pit lows are also fast, they have access to this as well. These are the only thing that are remotely out of the game. I guess I could put them here. But really, I don't care. They're only maniacs, so I'm just keeping them out of the the game, and I'm not caring about it. That's what I was thinking, anyways, with this um, formation here. Yo, boom! Oh yeah, how many of you guys are gonna get Diablo three and gonna play it? Ah, 
I wish I... I it's a funny story of that, too. Because, um... The other day, like, Thursday or Friday, I got a call from eBay Games, which is a, a video game store. Kind of like GameStop, I guess. I think they're even, like, connected, GameStop and eBay Games, but... Never mind that. So, I get a call from eBay Games, like, Thursday or Friday, and they're like, Hey, your pre-order of uh, Diablo 3 is gonna arrive uh, next Tuesday. You can get it um, starting from 8 a.m. in the morning. And I'm like, uh, um, okay. Because I never pre-ordered uh, <laughs> Diablo 3, so I don't know. Is this a... Um, I was wondering, is this a sales tactic where you're just, uh, for some customers, um, you're just giving the pre-orders if you're not sure whether or not they're gonna, they're gonna come. You give them pre-orders just to to to, uh, to incite them to, to to come in, to come and get the game. So I thought it was pretty amusing. I I said okay, like I didn't want to commit to not getting it yet. I was still hoping I I could get it, but I stared at my account some more, and I decided against it. <laughs> In the end, I already told you about that. So yeah, not gonna get it, but apparently I have a pre-order. Never pre-ordered anything, but well, not this game, anyways. Never pre-ordered it, but I still have the pre-order. Cool. I don't know. Don't care. Not gonna play it. Ah. <sighs> Maybe it's sad, I don't know. I just... I'm gonna play it eventually. It's actually really rare, the the games that I um, get... Um, that I, the games that I go get um, as they come out. I think I got StarCraft 2, that's the last one I remember getting on release. And then I can't remember another game that I got on release. That's crazy, isn't it? Well. I guess it's just the way it always turns out with me. I'm not trying to not ever get them on release. I'm just it just happens that way. Which is oh well, whatever. So they're attacking gated dementids. Okay. Goodbye, Skellies. And yeah. everything's uh, just dandy here. I don't think I even got losses, and I don't think I will either, because all that's left is um, melee. And not particularly good melee either. So, uh, I'm golden. I'm just gonna back off just a little bit. Not to get killed, you know. Alright, oh, so that's the Obla 3. I don't know who's doing Let's Plays. I'm gonna. I think I'm gonna Google it. Not Google it, but search it on YouTube. Just let's play Diablo 3. Let's see how many are gonna play this game. Because you know with the, the new games there's always this rage of oh, there's a lot of hype. Let's all play and let's play this. Right. Oh, kinda did that with Portal 2 actually. If I remember correctly. I, I remember my clad being really disappointed. He was like, had I known there would be so many people let's playing this game, I wouldn't have done it, so I don't know. There's probably gonna be a ton of people playing this game. That's just my thought. Hoi. Oh, I can charge them. Hopefully not hit the dogs too. That would be fantastic. Please. You suck. No, I don't want to know about the siege gate. God damn. You know what? I don't know why I did that. <laughs> I absolutely don't know why I did that. Let's kill them. You know what? I don't need to take chances. Let's shoot them. Then the next thing you know, they're dead. Like that. Goody! So I got one castle. Yeah. Got one castle. With another piece of moon silk crystal. Would you like us to watch over you in your tent? We can massage you to sleep. You can stay in my tent. I don't need the massage. Just 
wake me if I scream. Well played, Zana and Deva. You're that much closer to um, to the man you really, really crave about. I don't know. Just saying stuff. Anyways. Yeah, them succubi are not going to be sleeping with uh, our hero here. Carol. Yeah. Uh, do I have troops? Yeah. Mm, not the troops I want. I can't even upgrade those. This sucks. Okay, so anyways. I can't save this, but I have a teleporter right here. Yeah. So yeah, this is why you need to bomb rush this castle down here because as soon as soon as you get away from this, they can just charge down here and get there in a second. Uh, this is Javed. He has all of this and nothing else. That's cool. I can handle this. Yeah, definitely. This is no problem. All right, everything's going well. I might even succeed in my objective way earlier than I want to cause taking all these castles is supposed to take an entire video not video, two videos, one day of two videos yeah uh, going as well as it is right now it's, it might take less than that which would suck personally I think it would suck because, oh uh, yeah, I don't know, maybe I should slow down and talk about my life some more, why not? <laughs> Is somebody actually interested in that? I don't know. Uh, I don't know, I'm just talking. Hey, he's coming out. He's got some suicidal undead people on his team. Oh. Alright, can you charge and not kill? Never mind, I don't need you to. I was just gonna ask, can you charge and not hit the dogs this time? But who cares? They can do the job just fine. Alright, so you just wait there. Huh, you're in range of the ghouls. Yeah. Make a getaway. Oh. Um. Let's get rid of these. And then the... Succubi can deal with the uh, skellies. Skelly is uh, here we go. Almost. Only five. I could. Oh, I was gonna say I could probably kill this with Kiro, but no, they healed. So, yeah, five. I could have killed that with Kiro. Not now, though. Of course not. So anyways, I'm going to move you forward just a little bit so that you're more in range of stuff happening here. And can you, like, charge? Heck yeah. Let's do it. Horror! You need to not ask him to go to the maximum of his... Uh, if you ask him to go to the maximum of his uh, movement range... <sighs> My things here are in range of the ghouls, but if you ask him to go like here, he won't hit what's right in front of him. But he will if he has one more movement, which... I'm not entirely certain how that works, but it does work like that. It is what I have observed, thus it must be kind of true. Oh, shoot these, because they're in range of my uh, juggernauts. I'd rather keep the juggernauts alive as much as possible. Hey, he, they almost cut through the reinforcements. Not quite finished yet. Oh, come on. You're no skeleton. You're harder to hit. Not hit, but kill. Yeah. Logically. I mean, ghouls do have this bonus against... Uh, against uh, physical attack. And I think my... Uh, yeah, it is physical. Because uh, it's a might hero. Alright, let's keep... Oh, you're gonna kill him. Yeah, yeah, kill the ghouls. And then the succubi are gonna deal with the ghosts. After said ghosts come out? Nope. Okay. Whatever. They're coming out! No, you can't do anything about it. You're a risk. Don't do it. There we go. Don't need to take risks taking damage from the counter attack if they don't do their maximum damage. You can just 
Woo, hero 16. Yeah, something I forgot to get is this. This plus this makes creeping very easy at the beginning of the third map. Because, uh, that's something I observed. Well, you're going to see once we get there. I don't have to tell you now what's what. 